Hello ladies and gentlemen, Blank Check here, and today a short video, and that's a relief after Forgotten Friendship, which should be up on the channel by the way. This is Secrets of the Main Six, the newest animation from Forgalorga, and his first one since Your Little Cat three months ago. Forgalorga makes some good pieces of comedy, and I see Starlight on the thumbnail surrounded by Twilight Sparkle paraphernalia, so I have some high hopes, and I assume this will be less the cute comedy of Your Little Pets, and more along the lines of Starlight Once Your Cutie Mark. That is, I would be surprised if some of the secrets here were not, at the very least, embarrassing. I'm guessing this video will be seven scenes, maybe eight, one for each of the main six doing something they want no one else to know about, along with an opening and or closing with Starlight, who I would not be surprised is the one discovering these secrets. As a Forgalorga video, any surprises will likely come from the content rather than the style or the structure, so let's see what he has to show us. Alright. Blinky Twilight. Seeing all her friends, including the blur going by in the distance. But she can make six more friends! Gen 5, here we come! Oh, Twilight's the one stalking them! Not Starlight, alright! I did not expect that. I'm okay with it though. Let's learn all the secrets. Pinkie Pie is, uh, Tien. A distant cousin of Tien from Dragon Ball Z. Gummy is a Chiaotzu. Alright. Rarity, what alien artifacts do you have hidden in your gem collection? She has Mafia ties. Is that cat food? Does she feed her cat with a... Uh... Oh, never mind, those are, uh... Thought they were mice. This is worse, actually. <laughs> How can Fluttershy condone this? The little Pegasus is running a racket on the side. Alright, Rainbow Dash. She's actually a robot. Her robot sleeps for her while she does all the interesting things on the side. She explores dreams, like in Spongebob. She's just really uninteresting. That's the secret. You were all wrong. Oh my god, really? <laughs> That's not a secret. You live with her, Twilight. You already know this. You walk by her room all the time. Dang. She always gets away as you look at her. Rainbow's dead. Oh, okay. She's a sloth. She has a superpower of being able to fall asleep instantly. Oh god. Fluttershy is deaf, actually. That's the secret. No, not her shed. Twilight, stay out. You don't want to go in there, girl. Oh, God. Here's Johnny. She lets out her aggressions. Twilight, stay away. You don't want to know where the axe has been. Good. That's fun. Twilight. The ultimate tree. Well, I can sense a bucking coming. <laughs> it's it's not the that she has a horn. Or that she hides it in her hair. It's just how tiny it is. That's amazing. I have not seen anything quite like that. Kudos! That one was actually really good. Time to find new friends then. And then Starlight finds it. Oh, hey, Starlight. 
Man, if only my cutie mark were more... <gasps> it's her! Oh god. They're multiplying. We will conquer the multiverse. You, me, 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 and me. They were all very surprised. Starlight's a very deer in headlights pony. That was fun. I like these. Alright guys, that was Secrets of the Main Six from Forgalorga, and as expected, it was a little weird and a lot of fun. I was about to say I was disappointed we did not see Twilight's secret, but then I realized we did. She's a stalker. We started with Pinkie Pie, which is a good choice because it's a strong opener, it's weird, the weirdest one here, but at the same time, it's Pinkie Pie, so it's not surprising whatsoever. Rarity was a good bit of fridge horror, bringing to life that moment after an episode when you think, where did they get that fur coat? But her buying it in secret from a nonchalant Fluttershy is what really sold the scene. The Rainbow Dash scene might be my favorite, I really love the anti-joke of her just being boring and lazy. Starlight having a shrine to Twilight is honestly not that big a deal compared to what we've seen from Forgalorga in the past. Fluttershy's shed is totally fine, it's always a good reference. Best visual of the video though, and one of Forgalorga's finest, is Applejack's tiny nub. And if, before the video, you told me blank, be prepared for Applejack's tiny nub, I would be very concerned. This was, once again, yet another visually creative and well-edited video from Forga. I'm glad he continues to pump out videos, and with Season 8 at our doorstep, I hope he gets more inspiration. Thank you for putting this together, and thank you all for watching! Until next time, remember, we all have our little secrets.